everyone, I'm Kate Schwenke and welcome back to my kitchen. I'm super excited today because I have finally, after like 14 years of using the same stuff for my kitchen, I finally did a haul for all things aqua and mint. <laughs> and I'm super excited to share it with you guys because as a lot of you know, I am totally obsessed with this color. I incorporate it in my home decor, but mostly it is in my kitchen. I have a mint Keurig over here and I also have an ice blue KitchenAid mixer that I absolutely love. I also incorporate it into my dishware. <laughs> the only place that I hadn't incorporated it is actually my kitchen accessories that I used to bake with, cook with, and all that stuff. So what really sparked this, because I've been wanting to do it for years, but what really sparked it was that I was looking for a pair of dish gloves in this beautiful aqua color and I came across these on Amazon like I did with so much of what I have in this box and I will link as much as I can down in the description below for you guys and those are Amazon affiliate links so I would love if you would shop through me but I found these on Amazon they are by Wahoo uh, I have another pair of these in like a pretty lavender color that are lined these are unlined but when I saw these I was like this is exactly the color I was wanting it is perfect it matches my mixer <laughs> So um, if you love all things aqua and mint or teal, you are in the right place if you are looking to overhaul your kitchen accessories. So here we go. The first thing I got were these beautiful minty aqua dish gloves and I've used them several times and I love them. The next thing I got were these KitchenAid straining bowls because the ones that I have, like I said, most of the things that I have that I'm replacing are like 14 years old, which is how long I've been married. <laughs> So um, I'm super excited about this. So I got this nice strainer bowl. This is a KitchenAid one. You guys can see that has a beautiful aqua sky color. Now aqua sky is a little bit darker than my mixer. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's got just a little bit more blue and is a little bit deeper, but aqua sky and ice blue look great together. So, and that is mostly what KitchenAid really makes in this particular color is the aqua sky. So if you think, I don't know if it's gonna look good with the ice blue, think again. <laughs> it's gonna look great. And so I have the smaller one. I think this is a three quart bowl. And then I got a five quart bowl. And they have a smaller one too that I think is a one and a half quart, but it was, it's not something that I felt like I really needed because I have this super cute aqua Tupperware one that I use. So this is my larger one. I've used these a few times and I love them. They are heavy duty you guys and I love the rubber grips so if you guys are looking for a new set this is a great option it also has rubberized feet so yeah <laughs> I love these strainers let's move on I have so much in this box oh if I didn't mention it this was for my birthday <laughs> I did a massive birthday KitchenAid and Amazon haul a few things I got from Mercari but most everything I got from Amazon. So with being kind of stuck inside these days, we can't really do much outdoor shopping. So I also got these, my kids, well, especially my little guy, he chews on his straws like crazy. He is three. <laughs> and so I found these in the colors that I like. These are made by Replay. I love these. They wash up great. Um, these straws are super strong, so you don't have to worry about your child chewing through them. And um, they're just great, they, they're so durable. So this is what the inside looks like. Hopefully you guys can see, okay. This was just their um, green and teal set. And I will link these down below for you guys, but I love these. I have a set, this set, and then I have another set in green as well. So I have four and they are amazing. I love them. Um, next, Mm, there's so much in here to go through. I think I'm gonna start with all my KitchenAid accessories that I ordered together because, um, well, some things I got are KitchenAid and some things are not, but everything matches, of course, because I wanna be able to open up these drawers back here and be like in love every time I open it. I want everything to just make me happy and this color does, I don't know why. <laughs> so a lot of KitchenAid accessories I already had, um, but then I replaced them with this color. So I have like some white, some black KitchenAid accessories, but I definitely needed this color. So I have a whole bunch now. <laughs> okay, so the first one I'm going to do 
is I got this ice cream scoop. My old ice cream scoop is just solid, silver colored, and just boring. So I got this one in Aqua Sky. It's really pretty. It looks really durable, so I'm excited to use that. I also got this peeler. It's a swivel peeler. They have a few different options for this particular type of peeler, but this one has been my favorite. Like I said, I have like a red one, I think, <laughs> and it's been great. I use it for potatoes, apples, you name it. I also have this. I have another one of these in black, um, so I'm probably gonna keep that one just because I love these so much and we use them for so many different things. You don't have to just use a pizza cutter for pizza. I use it to cut shapes out of my kids' sandwiches and I use it to cut brownies and like all kinds of things. So I needed more than one, but of course this one needed to be aqua. So I also got a metal whisk by KitchenAid. This is their Aqua Sky, of course. It looks really nice. I can't wait to use it. As you can see, most of this stuff is unused and I've just been dying to film this video so that I can use everything. I also have this can opener. Now I already have a great can opener that I got from Bed Bath & Beyond, but it needed replacing because it was red and black and did not match the rest of my kitchen. But I really am looking forward to trying this one out. It's really pretty. So yeah. Okay, so those are all the accessories that were on top anyways. Like I said, there's a lot in here. Okay, um, this I love and I cannot wait to use these. Rachel Ray makes some really great color combinations that are super complimentary to Aqua. So I found this set and it, this is what kind of led me down the rabbit hole because when I saw this color combination of the Aqua with the super pretty dark teal like this, I fell in love. I thought, you know what? <laughs> My kitchen doesn't need to be just aqua. It can be variations of colors and make it a little bit more fun in here. So I thought, why not throw in a little bit of teal? Plus these bowls looked amazing. And when they arrived, they were heavy, you guys. Like these are heavy duty bowls. So there's a beautiful aqua color there. And then you have the green, and this is the smaller mixing set. It says two piece mixing bowl set. It has a two quart and a three quart mixer bowl. And then I looked to make sure that they had an even bigger set, which they did and I was super excited about. So you have another big one in aqua and another big one in the teal. And this is a four quart and a five quart. One of the things I loved about these was that they have the handles up here. They have a pour spout here and on the bottom, there's a ring of rubberized material so that they won't slip. But also, I didn't know when they arrived that they were gonna be that heavy. So I love that they are super durable feeling. So those are my mixing bowls. Rachel Ray, you guys. I got a lot of her stuff because I just, once these arrived, I was like, I have to have more, I love it. So those are my mixing bowls. I hope you guys are having as much fun as me because <laughs> I am having so much fun going through all this. Oh, also, so my mom, a lot of you guys know she recently moved out here earlier this year and uh, she makes me things all the time because she likes to sew, but she made me this little pizza cover. I don't know if you guys can see that. Isn't that cute? It's like coffee themed, but it's mint. So this already comes with a little plastic cover, but she wanted me to have one like this. So she wanted me to include it in my video. Isn't that cute, you guys? <laughs> I love it just special touches, you know? So, okay, next, I do have some more Rachel Ray stuff, but I think I'm gonna just go from the top to the bottom. All right, so these I found on Mercari, and I am obsessed with them. These are actually made by Farberware. Now, I did look at the KitchenAid measuring spoons and measuring cups, but the aqua sky on that just seemed a little too deep for me. I don't know what it is about that particular set, but it seems too dark for me. So I found this set on Mercari, and I know you can find these in TJ Maxx and Marshalls. So I did not find these on Amazon, but yeah, aren't those really cute, you guys? It's just different shades of mint and aqua, and I'm obsessed, I love these. <laughs> so yay, I can't wait to use all this stuff. I also found this set, it's a two um, prong type of set from Amazon. These are not KitchenAid. I did look at those, but these were cheaper and it came in a pack of two and they're basically the same color. It says all win houseware, 
But like I said, I will link everything down below. I got these on Amazon and I'll show you guys the color combination so you can see that they're not too different. See? And they look really, really nice and easy to use, so. <laughs> Next, I also found these in, these are from Marshalls. I got these for $6. And they're just a really pretty aqua silicone whisk. So you guys know I already have my KitchenAid metal whisks. Sometimes you need a metal whisk for things and sometimes you need silicone whisks for things. So I needed to replace both. And I'm super excited to try these out because they're really, really pretty. And all the ones that I found on Amazon, I just wasn't a fan of. I even ordered a pair that I returned after I found these ones because I like those better. So, all right, so this I also got at Marshalls. And these are just little shelves. Um, it's a pack of two. I don't know if you guys can see that, what they look like. But they're really pretty. It's the color that I love. So sometimes I just can't walk away from something that's this color and I have to have it. So um, I may put my pans and things on here. I may put plates. I don't know. <laughs> I'll find out after I open it up all the way. The next thing I got, and I actually have more things coming from this. Now I am a huge all clad fan. I love their pots. I love their kitchen mitts. I love their pot holders and things like that. All their stuff is just very high quality and super well made. So I found this color on their kitchen gloves because I've been needing a new pair. Sometimes they get too thin after you've washed them, regular ones, <laughs> and then you can burn yourself. These feel super well made. The whole inside is just really cozy, but this color was just so pretty, you guys. And they're really nice. Hopefully you can see it and it's not trying to focus on me but it has grippers on the fronts, on the backs. I actually had purchased two separately, so it ended up being like $29 for the pair, but they're really nice. I really like them. And I have two pot holders coming too. Okay, next I have some more Rachel Ray stuff. So, these are, I believe, the marine blue color. Now there's three different shades of blue that Rachel Ray offers. So I got all three because they look fabulous together. I think I'm gonna go ahead and pull all three out because I thought these would just look really, really good in my drawers together. Oh yeah, I forgot I got that too. <laughs> okay, so these are the three colors. Aqua, marine blue, and this shade, which I don't know the color name, but this shade is the same color as the bottom of the bowls from the mixing bowl sets. These spoons are so heavy duty, you guys. They're like fully rubberized. I don't know how to explain it. They just feel like they're gonna last for forever, and I love that. Now the other pieces don't necessarily feel that way. Um, the handles on these are that rubberized material, but the spatula is the same material as this. These are fairly lightweight, so hopefully they hold up, but the colors are just so pretty together. So in this set, I got two spoons. I got a fish spatula, and I got like a scraping mixing type of spoon. And then like I showed you guys before, I have a mixing spoon and more of like a ladle type of spoon in this one. And here, I may have to open it. All right, woohoo, I did it. All right, this is like a really long spatula. It's basically a spatula set, but they're so pretty. <laughs> so I have those two spatulas there, and then there's this one, which is kind of more like a spoon. So I basically have a lot of spoons here, but I do a lot of cooking around here with three little boys and a husband. So I just love these colors together though, you guys. They're so pretty and complimentary. I love them. <laughs> All right, next, I did get, I wanna show you guys this real quick. So I got this mat, it's a drying mat in the color Rainfall by All Clad. I have a lot of like swell bottles and things that I often have to wash by hand, which I hate doing, but I hate using paper towels to have them dry on because that's wasteful. So I figured if I have a drying mat, this one is really good size. If 
I have a drying mat, I can just lay them on top of here and just reuse it and wash it when I need to. So that's what I got for that. Next, I also got a knife set by Rachel Ray in that really, really pretty color. I, there's got to be something on here that says what color this is because it's so pretty. It doesn't say, but it's that same dark green teal color. So here you go. Hopefully you guys can see that okay. They look really nice. I cannot wait to use these. They feel heavy, which I like. <laughs> and on the back here, you guys can see they each have their own shapes. So I found that super great because I don't like having knives around without sheets because of kids, you know. So I got those knives and then I have this, <clears throat> which has absolutely nothing to do with the color teal, aqua, or green, or anything. <laughs> But I really needed some new cutting boards, so I got this cutting board set from Amazon, and they are bamboo. And one of the things that I looked into is, I've always used plastic type of cutting boards, and I hate them, because every time I cut something, it just makes a new groove into it. And I don't like having to throw out things so often, because you can't leave, you know what I'm saying, you can't leave cuts in there in the cutting board, because bacteria and all that. So um, I looked it up, and wood is basically like the best thing you can cut on. So I'm gonna try these and see what I think, but they look really nice. It's a set of three. So that's all I had in the big box. Next, I got more Rachel Ray. <laughs> Ugh. Okay, so I may have to clean off some of the counter. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, so like I said, I got more Rachel Ray stuff. So I found these pans on Amazon and I have been needing to replace my pants for a while. I go through pans like crazy, but this time I wanted to get a really, really pretty set. So Rachel Ray makes this set that is called Latte and Marine Blue. And I got two cookie sheets that are big. I can't wait to use these. And they're just so pretty. The color Latte is kind of like a mix between a, a gray and a brown and it has a shimmer to it it's non-stick it's really pretty it also has these grippers on the sides here and these go all the way over to the other side so you won't burn yourself even if you are wearing gloves and you're holding this for a long time that'll keep your hands safe so i really like that then i got a second one of course <laughs> gotta have two lucky pans at least I also got her mini cupcake tin. I like to make little brownie cupcakes because they end up so amazingly chewy and my husband loves chewy brownies, so I found this is a great way to do that. So I got a mini cupcake tin as well. And then I got two regular size muffin tins. I'm gonna only show you guys one because um, they're basically the same, <laughs> but uh, this is a 12 cup muffin pan and then I have a second one. So We are almost done you guys, I promise. I know this is a long video, but um, I'm having so much fun opening my birthday presents. The last time I did a birthday present opening like this was my unboxing of my mixer over here and it was so much fun you guys. I just, I absolutely love this color. Now, Amazon like shipped this in, in its own box. Here we go. And then they used their tape, which is so hard to undo. All right. So this actually came as a set on Amazon. It comes with a cookie sheet, I think a smaller one, the one I've got, and then a smaller muffin tin and two cake pans. I've got it upside down, of course. Flip it, I guess. I mean, it was kind of somewhat upside down, but not really. There we go. This is a more normal sized cookie sheet. So there it is. They also have like a huge set of this stuff for sale on Amazon, but I kind of wanted to pick and choose what I was adding in, if that makes sense. <laughs> so here is the cake pan. I plan to hand wash all these. One of the things I feel like I've made mistakes with over the years is always putting these types of things in the dishwasher when I really should have just 
hand washed them. I hate hand washing, but now that I have a nice drying rack, maybe I will actually hand wash. <laughs> All right, so, and this is the last thing I have to show you guys, my little six tin muffin pan. It's so cute. <laughs> So that's it, and um, I recently did show you guys on Instagram, and if you're not following me over there, I would love to see you guys over there. I will leave my information right here and in the description below. But I recently shared over there a little sneak peek of my pantry, and I have so many people ask me questions about it. So I'm gonna go ahead and link my video for my pantry organization right here for you guys so you can go check it out. And if you missed my unboxing of this amazing mixer over here, I will link it right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as much as I did. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and definitely subscribe while you're here. Thanks for watching.